Hey guys, how's it going? This is Pure Lou, Real Wheel Deal, and today you're watching us unbox the Volk Racing TE37SL made by Rays. Alright, so first thing you got here is your label. Volk TE Racing TE37SL, of course. So this is a 19 by 9.5, offset at 22, and you see this is a 5 by 112, so this is a Supra wheel we have here. And PW, that's a color code, so PW for us means uh, press double black. And uh, here just has a quick image of the photo. Also, you know, you got your danger label that tells you the bolt pattern here. And of course, here we have our raised authorized dealer, sealer of authentication. So make sure you guys are purchasing from authorized raised reseller. That can guarantee your wheels are authentic and that you're supporting our industry. The first thing I'm going to have is you're going to have these uh, edge pieces. This is for the edge, just to protect the face of the rim. So this is how uh, they come packed, make sure your wheel's not damaged. And then uh, we have the top here, so that's just uh, more protection for impacts down front. And the first thing you're presented with is uh, your booklet. So this booklet inside there, depending on your wheel, it's going to have uh, some stickers. So for T37 SL, you have the spoke sticker, because um, the lip edge sticker is already stuck on, so I'll just open this guy up for you. Inside of your booklet, you have uh, your spoke sticker, and the spoke sticker is the official Volk Racing, Raise Engineering for the spoke of the SL. And this one I have is in like a nice chrome black design. This is because it's a pressed double black wheel, so that's the color you get. You might have seen these in red, fluorescent green, but uh, there's a variety of colors. This you have is a spoke sticker installation guide. It's in Japanese, tells you how to uh, stick your sticker on. I don't know, they don't really help a lot because uh, I botch a lot of them. So that's why I never stick stickers at a shop for people. And here you have a Japanese information booklet and information booklet uh, just kind of has your warranty card information. So this is a raised warranty card, you could fill it out and that kind of certifies your wheels for the raised warranty policy. And here you have a JDM booklet and the JDM booklet is an aluminum wheel user's manual. So it just kind of tells you like what to do with your wheel, how to keep your wheels in great shape, how to inspect them, how to fit them and all the torque settings and what you should and shouldn't do with the wheel, okay? And uh, also it has a great uh, guide for installing the center caps. So if you're gonna be running center caps on your wheel, make sure you know uh, what you're doing. But of course the SL, you can't run center caps. And the last thing here is actually uh, more for me than more for you guys. It just shows you that if I'm putting this wheel at the shop to put the R plus and the JWL uh, through the little spoke hole to uh, make a nice display at the shop. So uh, I've never messed that one up. So that's pretty good. Now we get to the wheel, okay? So first you got is uh, you got your raise uh, wheel condom, I would say. So it's pretty cool. I don't know if you guys keep these, but uh, I have a lot of these here. But if you like, you like them, you know, you can you can wrap it into a pillow and then you get your own little JDM pillow uh, in your mom's basement. I'm kidding, I don't judge. And the uh, next thing we go is, of course, the wheels. So this one is the front wheel of the Supra and uh, looks awesome, you know? When you get your wheel, you want to be able to uh, take it out, do inspections on it, and uh, we'll just uh, pull it out right now. So after you pull out the wheel, make sure at the bottom you have uh, your valve stem. So you can open this up, make sure you have your uh, raised valve stem inside your box as well. All right, so I'm taking out of the box. When you unbox your wheel, you want to be able to inspect the edge. So I inspect all the edge here, make sure there's no drops. I inspect all the back here. And uh, you know, I'll make sure you have all the stickers because some of the stickers are put on at factory. So I have the Volk Racing T37SL sticker. This guy comes already uh, placed from there. And of course, when you come to the back here, you want to make sure you have every sticker they provide here. So here I have uh, this uh, Ninja sticker similar to the box. I have, of course, my size offset and also um, the bolt pattern. I have my R+, Plus. this is the Spec 2 from Rage JWL. This is the Jasma sticker, that's VIA, and it's just a caution sticker. And I also want to check that all these, you know, there's no... Uh, metal loose or any metal shavings or any like not clean cuts that could like impact the wheel from being uh, right up against the hub and I think that's all we got for unboxing of the SL so all right so that's all we got for unboxing Volk Racing's T37 SL make sure you guys keep all your booklets together for warranty information and make sure you're buying your wheels from an authorized raised reseller that guarantees the wheels authentic and you have everything you need and it's been pre-inspected for you if you like this hit subscribe Comment below, I'm gonna link a couple of my other wheel videos. And uh, yeah, I guess that's it. 
So uh, if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go take a shower right now with my new raised shower cap. So have a good day, okay?